What's happening, my Android friends? David here, your Android junkie from AndroidSpin.com, and it is Wednesday, hump day. Well, I mean, I guess uh, it's going to be a short work week. Thank God, right? Friday off, hopefully all you have Friday off, all you Monday through Friday, 8 to 5-er people. Yeah, and that suck. We got a three-day weekend, and uh, usually uh, Wednesday is when apps get updated. Well, the Google apps, and well, pretty much lately they've been updating throughout the the week but uh we got some pretty important updates to talk about in this video so let's get started all right first off when it comes to google core updates well i mean we ever everything updated pretty much you know in the past week and i haven't done one of these videos in quite a while which i apologize for and of course you know given that google io was last week they updated some of their apps and uh, one really significant update was to google play movies and tv Okay, now you can have purchases appear within your YouTube app. Now this is pretty awesome right here. So if you were to purchase a movie, like say you see right here, you say well, you pur- purchase the movie big, you can actually watch it now within your YouTube app. That's pretty good. That is awesome stuff right there. So um, obviously when you purchase it, you can cast it. You can Chromecast it if you have a Chromecast. I mean, I really like this. I really like the fact that they did this. I mean, of course, you know, <laughs> given the internet these days, a lot of people don't really purchase movies off of uh, stuff anymore. You illegal downloaders, you. It's okay. We all do it sometimes. But I'm just saying if you actually want to do it the, <laughs> the legal way, you know, you can actually use your YouTube app to watch your purchased movies. Great stuff right there. So if you haven't gotten the update yet, check down links below. Um... We hopefully uh, we have the update for you as well as you know I have we have gaps early down there too that's where all the Google core apps we try to keep it as updated as possible any little it could be the smallest update and we'll have it in there so check it out guys let me know how you feel about this new feature Nova launcher Nova freaking launcher okay ever since this one ever since this launcher came into our lives and it was like how long ago it's been a while it's been what four years since since ice cream sandwich i know that and uh there's just it's it just yeah there's it it, it it will never go away i'm sorry i'm like getting all stuttery right now it never goes away i always go back to it no matter what i'll try all the launchers out there but i always go back to nova because it feels like home okay it feels like home and guess what nova launcher beta now has some android l goodies that's correct and they are pretty much the goodies that we expect you can get the icons like the the app drawer icon that white app drawer icon which i kind of like the clear one better to be honest um but it's okay but you get all the animations you get you just get a lot of little the little features that are found in android l which is great and we're, we're glad that these developers actually update what you know whatever version of android is out there they try to update their launchers to that and it's great so if you haven't tried it out with the new android l features check down links below you can actually uh we, ha- we actually have the download for you You can download directly to your computer or you can just you know join the beta if you have the beta check the beta updates you can just download it right to your phone check it out let me know what you think all right, and of course I said, you know, like I said, we have a bunch of the Google Core apps that updated. And, uh, another one that was had, that had a significant update was the keyboard, the Android stock keyboard. Now you can get the Android L stock keyboard on your device. And, uh, well, I mean, not much has changed. Just the look of it has changed. I've never been a stock keyboard kind of guy. I've always had a third-party keyboard, and uh, I've just never really dealt with the um, stock keyboard. I've always just been a fan of other ones. But, uh, yeah, if you want that Android L keyboard with the new color scheme and everything, which looks, you know, looks pretty. But, I mean, other than that, that's the only thing that's really changed. Check down links below. Get that on your uh, device and let me know how it is. And also hit that like, thumbs up button, guys, if you'd be so kind. Subscribe to the Android Spin channel if you have not already and please visit androidspin.com for your latest in android news and like i said there's gaps early for your google core apps click that one check it out make sure you got all the current google core apps and uh follow me on social media down there click on everything that's down there that's pretty much what i'm saying well all right guys i'm david your android junkie with androidspin.com and this has been app updates all right guys one more day and we're free all right talk to you later